This is a demonstration of the ADSB avoid feature that's coming out in Copter 3.4. Uh, right here, we're in the simulator. We're flying in loiter mode uh, in Australia. We've got a little multi-copter flying at about 14 meters off the ground. And in this simulator, we've actually got simulated airplanes that fly by. Whenever those airplanes come within 300 meters of the vehicle, it's set up to try and run away uh, 90 degrees away from the, the closest point that the uh, the plane would come to the vehicle. So what we'll do is just wait until an airplane arrives. So that you just saw one maybe fly across, but it wasn't close enough. Uh, so we'll just uh, wait around a little bit, and hopefully um, an airplane will fly close by, and we'll see this multi-copter uh, try and escape. I should add that there's um, actually various different ways that it can respond to um, a close call. Uh, it can trigger an RTL. It can trigger uh, you know, switching into loiter mode, um, it can trigger a climb or descend. Uh, it can also do a horizontal flight, or it can do a three-dimensional um, escape. So now it looks like there it goes. You can see it's running off to the northeast, and then the airplane flew by along this path. So you'll see it's uh, changed into mode 19. Uh, that'll, when this goes uh, live officially, uh, that'll be named um, Avoid ADSB. Looks like it's now running away from another airplane. There it goes. Saw it fly by on the top left. After it clears, uh, the vehicle slow down, slows down and stops. Of course, uh, just like any of our other fail safes, um, you know, the pilot can uh, retake control by uh, changing the flight mode. So I can change it to loiter and then have you know, full control of the vehicle. Ah, another plane has come by. And again, you can see it's running away at 90 degrees from the closest point. As soon as it's out of the way, it should uh, slow to a stop. And that's how it works.